Leah Smith leading off the bars lineup for head coach Jordan Weber and company tonight. Coach Weber's been pretty consistent on lineups throughout the season, so it is nice to see her give Leah a chance to actually get in the real lineup. Very nice first handstand. So far, so good. Just needs to dial in that stick. Yep, she dialed in that stick. That looks identical to what she showed in the exhibition routine. In attendance supporting her homecoming. Now to Jamie Pratt, the sophomore. Beautiful first handstand to the ray. A little rush there. But manages to pick it right back up and get that last handstand. And a solid landing for Jamie. Very good routine. Like I said, I did see a little bit of a short hand. But wow, what a great vault for the freshman. Reese Drotar on the bars for Arkansas three times this year with a 9-9-0 or better. So far, so good. She had a little bit of an issue with this landing on Sunday. See if she can get it tonight. Double A. <laughs> no issues there. Here's Jensen Scalzo. Couple of 9-9-0s this season. Wow, and Reese Drotar went 9-9-7-5. Very nice combo for Jensen. She doesn't need to get ahead of herself. Don't let the emotions get to her. Nice final handstand. Wow! <laughs> Those last two vaults coming in for Nebraska. Spots two and three in the lineup. Asia Hall and Isabel Sikon. New career highs for both of them. Aisha Hall picks a fine time to break out a career high, the former level 10 Arkansas State champ. As Priscilla Park takes the bars. Very nice, Ray. Huge height on that pack. Just needs to see if she can get on the stick train. <laughs> Too much juice. It's okay, that's still a great routine. Brings up Maddie Jones, closing things out in bars for the Razorbacks. 9.95 a few weeks ago, the highest on the team this season. Very nicely done there. She did have a fall on that scale on Sunday, but no issues with that today. Very good routine. Let's see if she can get the stick. <laughs> Fight for the stick. 